Hello, I'm Sergeant Ken. Now we're gonna take all of the abdominal and lower back exercises from this routine and put them in one fit clip. Let's start with the flutter kick. Let's go to our back sides. Bring your hands so that they're just to the side of your rear end cheeks or underneath for good support. Bring your legs out straight, flex your feet, and bring one leg higher than the other. Bring them about 10 inches off the ground. Now, when you start the exercise, you'll be moving your legs 12 to 18 inches in a range of motion. The closer you are to the ground, the more back muscles you engage. If your back doesn't feel good, then raise them up higher until your back gets used to it the next time around. Now, when you reach the required amount of repetitions or time in this exercise, stop, pause for a moment, then bring it up for the next exercise, which we call the dying cockroach. Your legs line up right over your hips, your hands point toward your toes, and then you double time trying to touch your toes while you do this particular exercise. Make certain that you have your feet lined up over your hips when you do this exercise. Then, when you've reached that part of the exercise limit, switch it to a box and reach. Keeping your shoulder blades off the ground, reaching on each side of your thighs, this works those as external obliques, or those love handles. Then, when you reach that limit, bend your knees, put your hands in a clasp position, and behind your head. Now, when you do the half sit-up in the cradle crunch style, make certain that you bring your elbows wide and put your chin on the ceiling when you come up and you tilt your hips up at the same time. When you reach that limit on that particular part of the exercise routine, then let's switch and flip on our bellies. For the last part, which is called a modified lower back bend, squeeze your rear end muscles, arch your back, get your knees and chest off the ground, and then squeeze a little bit more for each repetition, breathing naturally in through your nose and out through your mouth. Now. I said each time to do the required amount of repetitions or the limit. Basic on each phase of this routine will be 20 to 30 seconds. Intermediate, 30 seconds to a minute. Advance, one minute to two minutes per phase. When you're done, stretch out your trunk. Feel the warmth in your legs, your core, your back. Then you know you've done it right. Try it now.